welcome. We are officially two weeks out to Freedom Queen Live, the event of the year. People are in my DMs like, Bridget, I can't stop dreaming about coming to Freedom Queen Live. People are like, I'm getting my ticket. I have women buying their tickets from Bali. Like people are buying their tickets two weeks out to the event and they're coming from Bali. We are putting on, if you have your ticket, first of all, put an emoji in the comments if you have your ticket. We are putting on an event that has never been done before. The caliber of this event, the people that are coming, the speakers, what you get in your ticket is the value. You know how people say like you get all this value and it's like this really, really big number to price anchor you. It's like the value of this event is literally multiple six figures. You're getting information from people in four days that would have, you would have invested $500,000 to be there. Like, this is not an exaggeration. This is a fact. If you have your ticket, put an emoji in the comments below. We are like, tickets are flying right now. And so I'm bringing on a speaker who is an incredible woman. You are going... Bailey just actually joined the headquarters. Bailey, you can be there. And welcome to the headquarters. I'm bringing on an incredible woman who I have watched blow up in the last two years. And two years ago, she was like, I'm brand new. She was making, I think, $70 a month inside of her business, $70. And I've watched her build a movement a high-end movement, build a high cash months, have an incredible business while being a mother and, and, and doing it all. And so that is Brie. I'm gonna bring Brie up. Brie's gonna talk about why she's speaking on stage, what it means for you to be at Freedom Queen Live. Brie has gone to events before. She's gonna talk about why it's changed her life. And I'm so excited to bring her up. So let's get Brie on. And if you know Brie, Say hello. We have people flying from Australia, Europe, Brazil, uh, Sweden. If you're coming, put in, uh, let us know where you're tuning in from or you're flying from. Bree uh, Kane, welcome to the live. <laughs> hey, Bridge. How are you? So happy to be here. Oh my gosh. Whenever you know I'm around you, you're just like a huge light. Like you're just this glowing ball of light, and that's why you're also so successful. So tell my audience who you are, and then we'll get right into it. Yeah. Absolutely. Hello, everyone. If I haven't met you yet, it's amazing. I'm so excited to see you at Freedom Queen Live. My name is Bree. I'm a mom of three, and I was about five years into stay at home motherhood when I decided I wanted to go bigger. I wanted to do something for myself. I had been in direct sales, had been building someone else's business, and was like, wait a second. I can have my own. And it was in that time when I met Bridge. And just like she said, I was earning $70 a month, but I would see these women online who were earning 30K plus months. And that blew my mind because that was my first salary out of college for the entire wow. year. It was like, wow. this is insane. Like, <laughs> but also if they're doing it, why can't I? Yes. And what I'll say, for all of you who are listening, who are in the business building phase, I went first. I started investing. I started moving. It didn't make any sense for me to invest in Bridges programs based on what I was earning, but I knew that those were the moves that I had to make. And so when I was at the $70 a month mark, I invested in Bridges Mastermind, which was 2K a month at that time. And I was like, I don't even know how I'm going to pay for this. Funny story, actually, can I share <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> when I asked you? I even, like, because one of the things Bridge had told me was be resourceful, you know, like, you're going to figure it out. And just like Bridge, you and I were talking about is like the diamonds form under yeah. pressure. So I was yes. like, okay, I am going to figure it out. I actually emailed her after I had enrolled in the mastermind and said, hey, Bridge, can I trade, like offset some of the mastermind costs and provide virtual assistant yep. services? Yeah. And she said, no, in, in the most kind way. 
but it was that activation it was like well i am gonna go figure it out yeah. and very quickly i did and i then went from that 70 dollars a month to a 100k month 13 months later um and here we are now where we've done well over seven figures in revenue and we're inching up we're so close to the one million cash mark in the business wow. in less than two years i mean but that that's huge and somebody watching this right now is there seventy dollars brie and you were like, I'm in for a $15,000 mastermind at that time was the price. And you were like, I'm in, I'm doing this. But you've always been someone who gets in the rooms, who goes to masterminds, who invests in yourself because you know that you're the best asset. And I think a lot of times people hear stories like you. They hear stories where it's like, I went from zero to seven figures at record breaking speeds and, and times. It's like, but what, what were some of those maybe fears that you had, Brie, of around, let's say, going to events or getting in masterminds that you had to overcome that maybe yeah. somebody listening this has the right. same? Right. Absolutely. Well, of course, there's one, the imposter syndrome, where it's, you're like putting yourself in this room of people who are doing it. And I was like, but I'm only earning $70 a month. Yeah. But at the same time, it was always like, I just remember sitting at my kitchen table back when I was earning, you know, $60, $70 a month. And I would just write in my journal, like, thank you for my 20K months. Thank you for my 20K months. And I think I had at that point, like really calibrated my identity already to what I wanted to build and who I needed to be to build that. And so, you know, even though it was like, like my human side was so terrified. I'm like, this makes no sense. Like with the reality I see in front of me to invest in this mastermind, I just knew that like, the person who I was and who I needed to be to build a massive business, like would do that. And then yeah. it wasn't even a question. I was just like, okay, I'm in and I'm going to figure it out. And you, you always figure it out. Yeah. You always do. And it's like, stop looking for the way, be the way and you yes. have to, it's like, be, do have, be, Brie is always in the being. It's like, first I'm going to be that person. I'm going to have that identity. You and I were on a call before this talking about the energy. Like it's so, it's a big piece because there's no cap to your beingness. There's no cap to your energy. People like you, you know, the reason your business keeps growing, the reason Freedom Queen, somebody asked me the other day, like, how does Freedom Queen keep growing? I said, because I'm growing. Mm -hmm. You get paid to evolve. You're going to cap the algorithm. You're going to cap the strategy, but there's no cap to you. And by placing yourself in spaces that expand you, doing things that are uncomfortable, that's mm -hmm. what gets you to that next level. Absolutely. Absolutely. It's always about... You know, like for anyone who's listening, you want to build a massive business. Who would you be with that massive business? Yeah. What would you be doing? Like, would you be investing in team and systems and ads? Like whatever your dream business looks like, like make those moves now yeah. as that person. You know, for anyone that's coming to Freedom Queen Live, say hello in the, in the comment section. What does it mean for you, Brie? Like, why are you seeing, I know you have a bunch of people coming with you. Why are they coming to Freedom Queen Live? What have they been telling you about this event? Basically that they can't not be there. <laughs> and they're yeah. like, I just know it's gonna change my life. Yeah. And I can attest to that because, you know, I have three young kids at home, so it's not exactly like it's the easiest thing to just go take off for a weekend. But I had attended my first in-person event earlier this year and like literally emerged a different person. And it's and, like, I love our story too. Of, uh, the person that I emerged as was a paid global speaker, like just, you know, rocking it on stage. And I was even telling Bridge before our live, I'm like, I, that became my identity yes. the second I left that event. And I had shared that. Mm -hmm. And that was what that led, chills. like Bridge saw that. And she's like, I see it too, Brie. And I mean, that like, literally it was because I had declared and claimed and owned yeah. that and like ab absorbed the identity of a, a global speaker. Bridge is like, yeah you're going to come speak at the event. Yeah. I'm like, okay, here we but, go. But that's it. It's like you got in the room, you had that identity shift and you were rewarded. You know, you're rewarded for the risks that you take. If you want to mm -hmm. speak on stages, go to rooms. Yes. Like I've been, I've been seeing people's posts. Like you want to speak on stage, but you won't get in the room. It's like, yes. I love that post. Yes. It's so true. Yes. Like get in the room, put yourself out there. You are rewarded for the risks that you take. Mm -hmm. No one knows you if you don't tell people about it. And Brie, the reason why is you made an IG story after that event. I and did. you said, I want to be a speaker. Mm -hmm. And I wouldn't have trusted you to speak on stage at Freedom Queen Live if you didn't go to that room, mm -hmm. be in there. Because now I look at, oh, she means business. And I think that's like, 
if we just boil it down to what are people actually buying, it's who has confidence, who is a leader, who has a backbone, who is willing to go first. I don't care what you're selling, bookkeeping, be a VA, fertility, mindset coaching, you're actually selling leadership. Mm -hmm. So by you going to that room, I saw that and sought you out and looked at you and was like, you, you have to be on this stage. And, but that's because you did this, you did something that was difficult, challenging to fly and, and get childcare or whatever it is mm -hmm. you needed to do to make that happen. Absolutely, absolutely. And the other piece to this too, which I think is so valuable for you guys listening now or to the replay, is having the audacity to claim and not only that, but to ask for what you want. One of the things I did after this event, what Bridge saw, I went to my stories and I said, this was the vision that dropped in. Yeah. And, and I made a direct ask. I said, if you have a stage, I want to come speak on it. If you know anyone who has a stage, I want the connection. Um, if you want to create an event, let's do it. Like I, I made a very direct ask to my people. And I think that's something that a lot of people forget to do. Um, and, I, and it even created, I did a pro, I ran a program after that called the experiment, where I was like, what if we just ask for what we want every single day for a week and see what happens? And so I want to remind you guys who are Amen. listening to this, like make sure you ask for what you want, like open those doors so you can receive what you want. I've been praying all week and I love the, I've been praying over the, the verse, the ask and it is given, seek and just, you shall find, knock and the doors will be open onto you. Like that's my, that's your experience of building your business. That's my entire experience. It's like, you know, Robbie always reminds me, he's like, if you already asked God for it, why are you asking me again? Don't you trust? Mm -hmm. You already asked one. So like, it's going to happen, put it out there. And so what about for those people that like, they know they're coming to Freedom Queen Live, they're watching this, why do they need to be in this room? Mm. There's, there's so much to that. It's like, how do you put that in a sentence other than it's going to change your life? And I think it's the same where you're in a space that you've never been in before, you're meeting people you've never met, and it's in those times, like dare I say discomfort, where you're out of your comfort zone that you find out who you are. I mean, I had that first experience in college where I studied abroad in Spain and it was those six months that I finally was mm -hmm. like, oh, that's who Brie is because I know, you know, nothing around me is familiar. I got to figure out who I was. And so yeah. like, I am willing to bet with a hundred percent conviction that you go to Freedom Queen Live and you're in this new environment and, and like, not just any environment, like the 400 women that are there are like, like, powerhouse like it, it's going to shape who you are and give you clarity on what you're doing and, and your next steps like what happens after the event yeah okay but i gotta share something with you right now we are getting so close to freedom queen live 2024 the conference happening september 26th in tampa florida i am so excited like it is a four-day event we're going to have speakers, workshops, and I'm doing this event not because I want to have a room filled with every single person in Freedom Queen, but because I want to create an experience for you, an event horizon, a gateway where you leave never being the same, where you exit Freedom Queen live going, okay, I know what to do. I know how to build a movement. I know how to build a community. I know how to create content to serve them. I know how to sell and... I know how to be the one that can build the movement over and over and over again. That's the number one thing I keep hearing from people that have already purchased their tickets from Freedom for Freedom Queen Live is they're like, I'm excited about all of the content, but really what I'm excited for is to be someone and know that I can actually do this. I can build a multi-million dollar company. I can create something extraordinary over and over and over again and, and actually do it. So I'm so pumped. This is going to change the game for Freedom Queen. It's going to change your life. It's going to create a ripple effect in the entire world. Make sure you click below to get your ticket for general admission. Or if you want to be on a whole other vibe, join VIP and I will see you at Freedom Queen Live 2024. Like uh, your identity is going to shift. Mm -hmm. I have a post coming out today. That's, mm -hmm. There's a you before and a you after. Like yes. you will never be the same. You will never, ever, ever, mm -hmm. ever 
be the same after Freedom Queen Live number one. And we'll have future Freedom Queen Lives, but everyone will be the alumni. It'll be year two. You'll be different. You'll be walking the stage, getting your, your next awards, your whatever. I, I love this story. Russell Brunson told this story of Alex Hermosi. So Russell actually created the Two Combo Club because of someone like Alex. And he said, Alex Hermosi kept outgrowing the awards. And that's why he had to make more and more the 10 million and a hundred million. And so it's like, will you be that? Will you be the person mm -hmm. at Freedom Queen Live that like we have the multi-million dollar award right now in cash, but maybe next year we have one for 10 million oh, cash yeah. or 5 million cash. Or, you know, the one day there's a hundred million. It's like, yeah. it's not just Freedom Queen Live, the first one, but it's all the ones to come. And you have to be at the first one because we're going to make history in this room. I know. And I think, I think that's it too is like you guys all know if you're in bridges world like she's not going anywhere and what what's what's happening now like this is just going to exponentialize every single year and to imagine you saying i was there when i was there at this very first event in its infancy and like i was telling bridge earlier too i'm like i've been to you know some other events where it's the first two and i'm like this is just unlike anything i've ever seen so can you imagine if you're at this first event that is already like i mean insane like what are the next year's events gonna be like like we don't even know it's gonna be absolutely crazy like i can't even imagine i know it's it's truly um, um incredible we'll have like a freedom queen private jet or something like that for maybe for next year flying but it's like what are, I would love to know what you're most looking forward to at Freedom Queen Live because for some people it's the connection, for some people it's the outfits, but I just, I love learning. Like I love nerding out. Like you get me in that seat and I'm not moving. Like I have my coffee, my water, my people around me to mastermind with and I'm not moving nonstop notes. Like I don't care what I could wear pajamas and I'll be, a, you know, making a hundred million after this event. So it's like, yeah. what are, I would love to know, what are you most looking forward to at Freedom mm. Queen Live? Mm, absolutely. So I really like, I love these type of events because I just go in with the intention to like receive and be, and the, the couple events that I have attended this year, like truly what I look forward to the most is the unexpected. Mm. That just by being there, like the people I'm going to meet, the connections, the, like at, at one of the events I went to over the summer, it was like, we started this JV, like this, just this beautiful connection and synergy. I'm like, oh, we, we need to do a project together. Well, um, and it's just all well, the, the unexpected magic. And so I'm here and receiving yes. and claiming, like there's gonna be unexpected magic that's gonna happen at Freedom Queen Live. And I'm just open to it all. And it's like, you could be standing in line getting a coffee and you yeah. hear one thing. I, I was just, last week I was on a bus ride home from the, event to the hotel and the guy next to me was like oh i just sold my company for 50 million and i was like what a blessing to be you know i believe there's no coincidences god put me next to that person to ha hear that and be expanded and so it's like you're gonna learn while sitting in the chair at the event at all the speakers but also in line at, in the yeah. elevator and the coffee and that dinner and mm -hmm. your entire life is going to expand just through having those little conversations and you never know what magic will happen or that the reason why God's calling you to be at this event. Exactly. Exactly. And it's like having the expectation that it's going to be magic and your life is going to change and your identity is going to shift and your business is going to 10x afterwards. But then it's also having no expectations other than that intention because you're just there to receive it all and to be and just like see what unfolds. Like we already know it's going to be magic. So now we just get to experience. Yeah. What would you say to any mom that's watching right now mm -hmm. before we close out? That's like, she really wants to come because I, there's a lot of moms that are coming. Some one mom moved her baby shower and she already has a child. She's pregnant. Yeah. She moved her baby shower. One of our speakers is literally about to pop. Like she's about, she probably shouldn't even be coming, but she's like, I'm going to be there anyways. And, and I would say 50% of the speakers are mom, which is really incredible. And so what would you say to a mom who wants to come, but she's using the excuse of her children as the why is the reason she can. Mm. Mm. What if it was the reason you can, like you remember that you go first, your children are watching and following. And if there was something that they wanted to do, would you tell them no? something that you knew would expand them. No. And like, you have to treat yourself like your children and truly like how you want your children to be and grow and evolve. And truly one wow. of the things that has made me successful in business is that I 
there like right now my desk is in the ch my children's playroom like I i've it. never had a door where i can close i built my business from the kitchen table on a seven-year-old laptop and so i think it's like all these things in motherhood where we think we can't because mm -hmm. of xyz mm -hmm. but actually none of that matters like if you want to do it you will find a way if you want to be at freedom queen live you will find a way and it goes back to our conversation about asking for what you want. Yes. So here's a little hack. If you are talking to your partner, instead of asking for permission, ask for support. Hey, there's this event I really want to go to. Um, can you help me figure out a way to be there? Like, I, I want to be there. Let's, let's talk about how we can make it happen. Yeah. What about somebody who's this, uh, like a single mom, like asking your family for support? One of my, one of my clients who's speaking, she's bringing her baby. Her husband was supposed to come with her to the event to watch her their son and he can't come anymore mm -hmm. and so she's like bridge can i bring my baby I'm like bring the baby bring it on stage like get them inside of this room maybe some headphones so that you know it's not too loud but like what would you say to that mom that's like okay well i, I don't have support mm. it's like resourceful find the support exactly but what would you say find the support yeah bring your child i think that you know so often we think in business we have to be a certain way and you know it's like we have to have the the office with the door you can close or like you have to show up to the event and everything's perfect but i want to challenge you that your success in business is owning who you are and all of the unique things whether it's a chat like even your challenges are your power and in your story of like hey i i don't have any help with my children and this is how i figured out how to do the things uh, that i want to do in life and be in the rooms yeah. And it's like, that gets to be the way that you also serve and support your clients too. Like you get to be the walking embodiment of like, this is me living life fully, like the good and the bad. And like, that's your power. That's what's going to make your business blow up. You, you'll be like Brie telling the story of how that was the reason why mm -hmm. you built a seven figure business, speaking on stages, a hundred K months, mm -hmm. all because you said yes. So Brie, can you tell my audience, for those of you watching live with us with the replay, or we'll also put this on the podcast, why should they join Freedom Queen Live and sign up through you using your code? Oh, <laughs> because you get to be part of the best family and community ever. I already have a crew of powerhouse women going, and we have built a community for that crew even before the event. So you're going to walk in with best friends. I also think it's fun, too, if you come with a speaker, you obviously yeah. get a behind-the-scenes look at the event, like kind of part of the event inner circle, and I'm going to bring you into that experience. Um, we're also going to have a bougie dinner out in Florida. I love food, like one of my love languages, and so I want to share that with my community. Um, you also get a free one-to-one -one million dollar blueprint session where basically wow. I'm going to take wow. everything you and I just talked about, plug that into your business, and give you the roadmap to seven figures. Wow. Also, I have a great restaurant oh. recommendation. I went there last week, and it was amazing. It's okay. so, it was like the nicest restaurant and like the most delicious food in that area on the water, but you, you're right. Coming with a speaker is different than coming without a speaker. It is. And, and it, because when you're at the event and you're by yourself, it's different because you don't know anyone. And it, I can mm -hmm. be super introverted. I have to, I've had to learn how to put myself out there in person. Mm -hmm. But you coming with a speaker, like, first of all, everyone's going to be looking at Brie elevated on a stage going, oh, my gosh, she's a speaker. Like, oh, my God, oh my God I'm, <laughs> I'm talking to a speaker. Like, how can I meet you? Because that's the vibe. That's what people get when they see a speaker from stage. But the fact that you're coming with Brie, you get to see her behind the scenes, like all of the emotions and the data, the wisdom that you're gonna gain from speaking on a stage like this and being on that elevated space, like what a gift. Mm. What a blessing to have access to that. So if you are watching with me live, you're watching the replay, what I want you to do is DM Brie, mm. F-Q-L, and she's gonna send you the link to sign up for Freedom Queen Live and your special promo code and then you get unlock all these bonuses as well yes exactly yes i would be honored and i think you know it's everyone has their unique like vibe of the community and what i would say about if you are feeling nervous or just like oh my gosh like i don't know anyone that my community is full of heart like 
my mission and passion is to build a family and to see you exactly where you're at and where you want to go and just who you are and like hold space for that magic. Yeah. And so if, if you are a little bit nervous, like this is why you need to come with me because it's not just me, like the women that are, are coming in my community are that way too. And like, you will literally have a family at the event and even before the event. I mean, who, who isn't nervous? Yeah. Like I'm nervous. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is like, you know, but where there's fear, power is near. Like, do the scary thing. I'm, you are where you are today. I am where I am today. People coming to the event because you, you didn't let anxiety, nerves, fear stop you. And this, the, I think one of the things about the Freedom Queen community is, like, it truly is community, collaboration. People, people will genuinely care about, yeah, we are also super competitive. Like everyone in Freedom Queen is so competitive. You're like, I'm here to win, right? Like that's, yes. that's me, <laughs> that's you. I see Demi says, scared means doing it. Demi's coming, Demi's coming on the podcast tomorrow. It's like, but like your net, your net work is your net worth. And mm -hmm. you building these relationships, Brie, that's something that I've learned in such a big way. It's like, that really is it. The relationships, the people you know, and that's gonna deepen inside of this space. And you're gonna have so many friends. You're not gonna feel alone anymore. And you're gonna feel like a bigger sense of belonging after coming to Freedom Queen Live. 100%, 100%. And even like the relationship to yourself too, like not just your relationship with all the people that you meet in the community you go with, but it, I think you're going to deepen who you see yourself as, that your understanding, your appreciation for self, like you truly will be unstoppable. Like, remember that you will be unstoppable when you go to Freedom Queen Live. <laughs> I won't drop any swear words like the other time. <laughs> that was so funny, Bridget. <laughs> My God. So freaking good. Brie, anything finally you want to say in the last 30 seconds here? Yeah, yeah, yes, I do. What you, the vision that you have right now in the expansion of, you know, seeing, like hearing this story of going from 70 to 100K months and that I'm sure you have this feeling, like if you're in the middle of business building, you're like, I want that, I want that. I just want to remind you and tell you that you can have that. The biggest thing is like when you see that, ex that expander and that expansion, is that gets to be yours when you claim it you own it you move it and embody and like can we all just say right now like we are building seven figure movements you are building a seven figure movement and the more you tell yourself that and then be like okay that's who i am like let's go i'm gonna move as her like you mark my words you will have that by next year freedom queen live if you claim yeah. it today amen that was amazing closing note so with that being said message brie s Q L like I want my ticket. Get me inside of that room. I'm in. I'm ready to be there. We have two weeks left until so crazy. Freedom Queen Live. And Brie, I cannot wait to see you mic'd up on that stage, dropping bombs to the audience. <laughs> I can't wait. It's gonna be amazing. Okay. okay. I'll see All you right. at Freedom Queen Live. Okay. Bye, Brie. Thank you. Bye. Bye.